Just about in, set, and away they go. French leave, a little bit slow to begin. Capella Magna fails to muster any pace, and he's tailed off in the early stages. Western Dance, Rush and My Passion, Rocky Path. First three to break. Watusi's right there. Latin Opus at our outside. Littlewood, the two shades of blue. Sacred Dawn against the inside rail. Then comes Village Deep, Felt Flower. First half of the field covered by five lengths. Chevron, black and white colours. Zabajad was next best. Just over a length away to French Leave. Palace Green, the white blinkers, is racing about eight lengths from the leader. Then comes Nabila. That's the black cap at the outside of Fort Love. And Capella Magnus somewhat caught up past the 1800 metres mark and racing around a dozen lengths off the leader. They're going a better pace than they did a race earlier. And Rocky Path is on the sharp end over Latin Opus, who races in second. That travels at the outside of Rash and My Passion. Then comes Western Dance. Not too far off them is Watsusi. That's in the red body. And the yellow cap felt flower covers the most ground at the outside. Village Deep, one off the fence. Then comes Sacred Dawn, Chevron. They the next two. They midfield. They're about seven off the leader. Then a length away to French Leave, who's at the outside of Zabajad. Palace Green is in the black sleeves and the yellow cap. Three quarters of the way back. Nabila keeps that one company. Two lengths away to Fort Love. And then the back marker is Capella Magna, and they're about to be homeward bound with 1,100 metres left to go. And Rocky Path will guide them into the home straight. Littlewood races in second. Then Ration My Passion against the fence in third. Latin Opus has got fourth. Then back in fifth position, we find Felt Flower, who covered the most ground into the home straight with Tusi Yellow Cap at the inside. Western Dance. Then comes Village Deep in between runners. Sacred Dawns on the inside. Chevron Black and White, six to make up. Zabajad was next best. French Leave trying to make his way in between runners. Then comes Palace Green. He's still got his eight lengths to make up. Kept quiet for now. After them to Nabila. Fort Love and finally Capella Magna. They off the false rail. 600 metres to the line. The leader now is still Rocky Path but Littlewood right alongside as is Rash and My Passion. Then comes French Leave. Felt Flower was further back and running with two seat. Then comes Village Deep. Zabajad trying to make his way through the field. Rash and My Passion. Littlewood. French Leave back in third. Rocky Path is fourth. Then comes Village Deep and Felt Flower was further back. Littlewood, Rash and My Passion. French Leave not completely buried at the outside, but Rash and My Passion now turns it on again. And Rash and My Passion is going to come home and win it. Second goes the way of Littlewood. French Leave better run in third. Fourth goes to Zabajad. Fifteen Rash and My Passion wins. Luke Ferraris on board here for Gary Alexander. Your heart's firing at the moment. Jared Lawrence and Tessa Werner is the winning owners. Bred by Sir Patrick and Lady Hogan, daughter of Kate Blanco. Rash and My Passion, five-time winner from 24 starts. And again, Littlewood has had to chase her home. Rash and My Passion wins it by a length and a half. Littlewood didn't give up. Neither did French leave. Much better run in third. But ultimately, Rash and My Passion comes out on top in race number four. Second goes to number 12, Littlewood. Third to number 10, French Leave. And I gave Zabajad fourth. And so will the judge. Then came Village Deep, Fort Love, Felt Flower, Chevron, Sacred Dawn, Rocky Path. Palace Green didn't fire today. Then came Western Dance. And a long, long way back to Latin Opus, among others. So the winners towards the left-hand side, the White Blinkers, Rash and My Passion, given every chance. What I was... Happy to see from Luke Ferraris was before the race, almost doing what Joe Marrera does before a race, running them around in circles, keeping them warm, keeping them active, keeping the blood flowing. Ration My Passion arrives in race number four. Number 15, Ration My Passions Come Home, our jackpot bankers home in leg one. Gary Alexander, Dean Alexander, well done to them. Luke Ferraris to the Verners, of course. And this one bred by Sir Patrick and Lady Hogan. Uh, let's chat to uh, Luke Ferraris, who gets on so well with her. Um, chatting to Gary off air there, I thought you just put her in the right places at the right time. Another good ride there, Luke. Thanks. So, yeah, everything went according to plan. And, uh, yeah, I love when a plan comes together. But she's come through to win a nice race. Yeah, and you've now ridden her now four times uh, for two wins in a place. So, yeah, you and her get on well. Thanks, yeah, she's, she's, she's an easy filly to ride. Wherever you put her, she'll go. And uh, she, does, uh, so she does take a bit of a ride towards the end, but uh, she, I think she, she always is competitive with a lightweight over a long distance like this. And, yeah, she's proved it today. Well, then, too, uh, how's the course out there today? Lovely, sir. The course is beautiful. Lovely. 
Thank you very much. Big thank you to Mr. Verners and his family. Obviously to Mr. Alexander, to my sponsor, Aventure. Thank you. Thank you, Luke. Well thank done. You. All right, let's get Gary into the picture. Gary and I chatting off here. We both thought she had a good chance at the weights, and uh, you know, she's proved to come through and uh, be very competitive again. Yeah, she stays well. And you know, the New Zealand the horses normally come into their own as five, six year olds. But I've got to thank Lawrence and Tessa, and of course, Jared, for their support. And of course, Luke rode a good, very good race. And how's the stable flying, Gary? This must be lovely. Oh, it helps, eh? It, it does. Helps, especially in today's times, it's tough out there at the moment. and. Uh, it's always nice to go in with the winner. Because I remember I used to watch uh, you and Dean sit over there for those two months after lockdown. It was hard and well done, the circles turned. Oh, because you didn't know if you were going to race and not race. So the horses were on and off all the time. So I, did, uh, I didn't hammer my horses coming back. And uh, it's sort of paying off now for the yard. Wise man, well done. Thanks a lot. Thank you. Well done to uh, Gary. Well done to Dean. Well done to the Verners. And a nice ride here by Luke Ferraris. Ration my passion. 15, 12, 10 and 9. That's the result of uh, race number four. Jackpot 2 comes up next.